Hi guys, uh, this is Abhik and uh, so basically today I'll be talking about a couple of modifications that I did uh, to my bike uh, Honda Hornet 160R. So basically it's uh, just a couple of things which I have changed, uh, not much. There are some changes I have done to the stickering as you can see the sticker over here is not there. Uh, this one is an aftermarket sticker that I have put. Again, this is stock as it was, uh, however, I'd be making some changes to it. Uh, the major change which I've made to the bike is the headlight here. Uh, the headlight currently I've installed is of a FZ, FZ uh, 2.0. So I'll just show it to you guys here. So basically this is the headlight guys and I'll show it to you from other angles as well. So this is one change which I've made. Uh, apart from that, uh, you know, the number plate I have installed over here, the indicators, if you see, these indicators are, you know, aftermarket again. I have to make a lot of change just to this bike, basically, because uh, uh, the indicator option for FZ uh, was over here, which would not work for this bike, basically, because... Uh, you have heard this going inside so I've made these sort of changes and I hope you like uh, the changes I've made here so not too many changes but this is what I feel uh, would work for this bike and I'll show it to you from different angles and you can decide for yourself how it looks hey guys so, so this is how it looks from the front angle if you see uh, the headlight, I'll just turn it on for you. So this is the headlight guys. Uh, it is similar to the stock headlight. All the functions like the high beam, low beam, everything is working. And I have installed these indicators. This is how it looks from the front. They're not very bright. In the future, I'm planning to, uh, you know, kind of, uh, instead of these have one plan to change it for the KTM ones uh, that would look great on this bike so that's basically all the change I have made now I'll just uh, show you the angle uh, basically from the front how it looks like the dashboard I believe that looks quite great uh, you know if you compare it to the stock one which was there for this bike I believe that this looks very nice so this is how the bike looks from this angle at the top as you can see it looks quite aggressive now uh, you know better than how it looked before here if you check i have installed uh, the switch gears basically this would uh, you know this is for engine on off basically this costed me about you know 200 bucks now, if you want to know the total cost for the modification for this particular headlight i have almost spent about uh, you know 3000 for this headlight unit it is quite at the expensive side but you know, I believe this enhances uh, the look for this bike this is my personal opinion again you know you might or might not like this but it, I believe that this enhances the look of the bike and make, makes it more aggressive uh, do let me know how you think what you think about this bike and uh, yeah just share and uh, like or dislike depending on you know what you feel and let me know if you have any questions I'm happy to answer them thanks and have a great day guys. Bye.